Hey everyone, this is an unboxing video of The Last of Us, the Survival Edition. And I didn't think it was going to be this big. No, let me just say, this is a fucking huge box. Um, here, let's put one of their previous games on top. Just for size comparison, this is a game compared to the box. I was completely baffled at how big this thing is. But, yeah, Uncharted, I hate them. Um, but... This game has gotten absolute perfect scores left and right, so it was one of those things that I had to have. Um, so yeah, um, this is the box. It's pretty thick, as you can see. Uh, survival edition all around. I did not get the post-pandemic edition. I mean, I just, uh, as much as I like statues, it was just not worth the money to me. Um, even though I could have gotten it, I had the opportunity. So, yes, yeah, so it's going to come with an art book, which is probably why the thing is so huge. Um, a steelbook edition of the game, as well as a, uh, what do you call it? A comic book. And that comes some, with some DLC. Woo, we love ourselves some DLC, don't we? So, let's open up this thing. Um, i going to use myself some Superman. I'm going to cut this open. There we go. That's open. And here we go. So first off, we have the steel book. Looks really nice. Um, the disc is loose. Why they? I swear. This is stupid. But here's the disc, and it's not scratched. Thank God. But it has actually really nice artwork behind. So let's actually take all this out. You can see some nice little artwork. I love steelbooks. I, I really wish every game came with a steelbook because they're just very nice. Um, they definitely make your game feel like it's worth more. And it comes with some Naughty Dog stickers, you Naughty Dog. Um, and DLC, which the code expires in 2016. Nice. So we'll go ahead and throw this crap back in here. Put the disc, which, yep, it's not scratched. Alright, so that's the first item. Um, and my steel book is not dented, unlike the bastards that sent me this. Um, I ordered from Amazon a few uh, weeks ago, Perfect Dark Zero, and um, they decide to ship it and put it in the same packaging as a 24-pack of Red Bull. That was stupid, because um, the casing is all dented in. Um, as you can see, it's all dented. Um, I mean, the thing was only $10, but I'm really pissed off that it's all warped, as you can see, and dented. It kind of shows off there. But, um, as I can say, like, steelbooks are fucking awesome. Like, you know, they just, they just make the game feel more valuable. So we'll toss this off to the side. Alright, so that's one item. Next, we're going to pull out the book. Boom. Damn, this is a big book. Um, it's not embroidered. That, that's actually... or embossed. I keep saying embroidered. It's not embossed, which uh, is a shame. They could have done that. Um, very nice artwork. But it's called The Last of Us. There's the back. Very nice. Um, I mean, we can open up a few pages. Oh, they show you some early concept artwork. This seems nice. Telling you all the characters. This is actually cool. I'll have to check that out. And there should be more in here. Let's see. And we have the comic book, which is by Dark Horse Comics. This is issue one of four. There's supposed to be variable, which I don't understand why they do that, where there's supposed to be one of four that are in here. I think maybe the covers are different, but the content's the same. I don't know. Um, but yeah, it comes with this uh, comic book and everything. Very detailed, um, so as you can see. And that's it. So that's what $80 apparently gets you. So, I mean, it's, it's a huge box. I really am shocked, but it's because of the book, the game. And that is it. So check out future videos, guys. Um, if you have not yet checked out Ultimate Gamer Podcast, please definitely check it out. It's worth your time. And yeah, take care.